Hello and welcome back, beautiful Sagittarius. Thank you guys so much for all your warm, heartfelt gratitude that you've sent me over the last couple of days, guys. I truly, truly thank you. You're some of the most beautiful people I've ever encountered. Thank you so much, Sagittarius. Let's go messages for Sag. What are we talking about here? Sagittarian messages, please and thank you. The sun. Okay. The portal. Wow. I am in the divine flow and moving into alignment. Unity, balanced energy and manifesting stay open to all the good and beautiful things the magic mushrooms miracles opening up oh my god give to the mind and it gives back inspiration so sad Memento mori, life, presence, and depth. The meeting or the meaning is in the middle. The shaman. The insights, the cosmos, seeing power, beginnings, and transformations. Sagittarius, this is a bang up read. Your energy is valuable. Protect it well. The protectress, strength, boundaries. And you may be wearing or you're being told, well, an amulet now can be your third eye. Just saying. Hmm. This is really interesting. Hang on here. We begin a lot of shaman energy. Let's go. This is the third eye. This could be your amulet. Protect it well. Sagittarius. Open your heart. Not just a little. All the way. And let the love flow in. Stop trying to carry the world on your shoulders, Sagittarius. Stop looking outside yourself for the answers. You already know them. Listen to your body and do what it's asking of you. Stay present. That's where life is happens someone is in need of your love offer it to them hmm <laughs> okay i am the skeptic okay let's go someone is in need of your love offer it to them what's going on here for Sagittarius this is justice this is balance who is in need of Sagittarius's love who is what well, there you are, Sagittarius. Let's see. Could be a Queen of Swords. I don't know. Or are you the Ice Queen here? Some kind of battle. Okay. Could be that someone is in victim mentality. Or someone is worried about their health or is worried about their finances. You're over here. 
Ooh, well. Okay, so this could be... What the hell is this? Power struggle? It's to do something with you here being confident you're on some kind of new beginning. What is this? Why are the lovers here and soulmates here and judgment here and death? Hmm. Jesus. So it's looking like, okay, you got the Ace of Pentacles, the Ten of Pentacles, Sagittarius. Who is this? I'm trying to ask who needs your help. First card out was the Queen of Swords. Now that could be your energy with your heart chakra closed. Maybe you are the protectress. Maybe you are protecting what is yours, Sagittarius. Stop trying to carry the weight of the world on your shoulders, helping everybody out here. What the hell? Someone's jealous here, Saj, because you're getting justice. This is the yin and the yang. This is movement. This is taking control here. Why is someone... Who needs Saji's help? Someone's hiding something here, Saj. It looks like some uh, somebody's fighting the devil here. Or it could be a Capricorn who needs your help. I don't know. Someone is walking away. They're stressed out. Now, this could be a child... Or somebody is having nightmares. These are messengers, Sagittarius. It's like the Ace of Pentacles is always fantastic energy to get in a read. It is the cornerstone of the Ten of Pentacles. So you've got some major opportunity here. This is learning. This is mastering. This is counseling. Oh. Someone is working here. You're coming off as the high priestess. Somebody needs your help, and it could be, why are all these messengers here? Something, you're busy manifesting here. Why is someone carrying the weight of the world on their shoulders? Maybe you have taken on a lot of responsibilities, or this person around you has taken on a lot of responsibilities. It's like someone is carrying the weight of the world on their shoulders. It could be you, Sagittarius, or it could be someone around you. Looking like a king of cops is carrying the weight of the world on their shoulders. Someone may need your help, and I'm not sure how. It's like something to do with a 
Well, you're very loving. You're very nurturing here. And it's almost as if someone needs your help here, Saj. I don't know. Maybe they need help opening their heart. Or they need help. Um, this is messages. They want to message the Empress. This is some kind of news or messaging. Someone is in despair. Five of Cups, regretful. Um, they could be mourning. They could be crying over spilt milk. Uh, some, it's something to do with their heart chakra. Waiting, waiting to be guided, waiting to be led. Someone wants the truth here. So someone's very protective. Or is trying, or is feeling very defensive about some kind of choice or decision they, they are trying to make. Is this about what divine timing, toil and labor? Something to do with, um, oh, geez, there's a lot of forging here, like metalworks or something like this. Someone could be a forger or like um, a steel worker or someone who is does something for their work that creates things. This is like what is this? This is a Knight of Cups. It could be a romantic interest or someone. This can be support. It can be a romantic offer. It can be an apology. Someone is feeling. Well, they're looking at that cup. That spirit's handing them. See, in all the other decks, the Four of Cups is like, this is someone who is the opposite of that. This is someone who's got their eye on what spirit is giving them and is not looking at the other cups around them. This is someone who has got their eye focused in on what spirit is saying and what spirit wants to offer here. And presenting that, taking that cup and presenting it. Yeah, this is the Wheel of Fortune. Looking at some kind of, someone's experiencing some kind of tower. Um, these are messengers. They're looking at that cup that spirit offered them. I'm telling you, they got their eye focused right on that cup. That spirit is offering them something. They're not interested in the other cups that are there. They are interested in the cup that spirit is offering. That could be you, Sagittarius. Or someone around you. It could be a king of pentacles. It could be family. This is someone with a lot of valor. This is someone with a lot of... Uh, it could be someone in your family. 
or who views you as family or you view them as family. Um, someone's trying to make some kind of choice or something. Oh my God, this is love here. Make sure your heart space is open. Not just a little, a lot. Someone's going to take a leap of faith here. This is um, the Virgo energy. It's also a sage energy. It's like introspection. Someone who has gone within for healing. Someone is going within for healing. Hmm. Looking like the light is shining on the star. This is the King of Pentacles I'm talking about. It could be a Virgo. Uh, or it could be, well, it's there. What is this hermit looking at? Oh, yes. The hermit sees the snake that's before its feet. This is like crossing the bridge, going across a bridge, seeing a poisonous snake on the pathway, but it is clearly lit. Oh, whoa, shit. Those swords have not, what? The world. The three of cops. Holy shit. This is healing energy. Rest and rejuvenation. You might be giving advice to somebody. Someone does need your help. Or needs your love, your healing love. Offer it to them. Hmm. Someone is going through something very painful. Is this person deceased? Is this a doctor? <laughs> Somebody is pulling out of their box these coins or these amulets. Okay, someone's looking for your love, Sagittarius. Make sure your heart is open. I can actually be talking about your heart, or this person could be having heart issues. I'm not sure yet. Let me clarify. Let's get a couple more messages on this. Who needs Sagittarius' love? Who is it that needs Sagittarius' love? Who is this? 
Your energy is valuable. Protect it well. Who is this? Live your life with both feet in it. Commit to fully being here. Take responsibility for your choices. This is your life to live. Own it. Stop caring about what other people think. This is your life to love and to live. Be authentic. Anything else is just exhausting. Never forget how resilient you are. You will always bounce back. Life can be hard and life can be wonderful. Which one will you focus in on? So it's clear that somebody is focusing in on some kind of victim mentality. Like, woe is me. Someone could be very depressed. Someone, I don't know who it is. It says family. Who's the person who needs Sagittarius's love? Who? Who's the person who needs Sagi's love? Who? Who? A Leo? Or support, a page of cops. Oh my God. Someone is going, I don't know what this is. This is a lot of pain. Someone is going through a lot of pain here. Someone needs emotional support. Maybe finances. I don't know. Someone is really stressed out. And it's looking like they're feeling insecure. And it's looking like... I don't know what this is or who this is. First, uh, someone's scared. About their finances or their health. Looking to you here, you could be healing, Sagittarius, or someone wants you to heal them. Learning the consequences of some kind of decision to walk away. Someone's Heart space was closed. It's King of Swords. It's others. What the hell? Trying to control some kind of devil energy here what the hell don't even go there this is death 
neglect ne is someone neglecting their health I hope it's not you Sagittarius but it's saying that someone could be neglecting their health this could be a relationship someone has deep regrets and is stuck in some kind of regret or remorse or shame or guilt this could be that someone needs your love or your counseling or your advice or your or your wisdom here Saj there's a lot of messengers here you could be receiving a lot of messages protect your energy be careful not to like who you give your love out to it's saying that someone needs your love give it to them So it's like this is about someone wants to work on some kind of reconciliation with you. They want to talk to you. Something is on. They're troubled about um, like they know they can count on you for the truth and your positivity and your balance here and your patience oh jeez wow could be another fire sign Somebody is like jealous here that you are the star, that you're healing, that you've got a new cycle. You're receiving some sort of good news, Sagittarius. You might be hearing someone uh, from your family. Someone wants to talk to you or is going to reach out to like this um this virgo or this someone's depressed at home reminiscing about the past oh my god someone's thinking Somebody be, could be running from something or has been trying to avoid something. It's looking like a lot of communication. A lot of different people you could be communicating with, Sag. It's like someone is carrying the weight of the world on their shoulders. It could be you. Um... People demanding a lot of your time and energy or hmm.
like you're coming off as very loving, very supportive. Someone's very defensive, very protective. Somebody's like, well, it's like, never forget how resilient you are. Maybe that's the advice you're giving someone. Life can be hard and life can be wonderful. Which one will you focus in on? Hmm. I tried. To get this answer leo has come up an awful lot so did virgo it could be a leo virgo cusper a cancerian um a king of swords gemini libra aquarius masculine it's looking like it's a family member Someone is definitely missing your love or your affection. And it could be a family member. Sing. Someone could have like the spirit of the eagle as well. This could be a divine messenger. This is healing. Someone's looking for a healing. Or is looking to heal something with you. I don't know if someone's sick. I don't know if someone's in victim mentality or they're in a sadness, a depression, and ill. Give to the mind and it gives back. what you feed your mind. That could be the advice that you're giving someone. Sagittarius, you... Your energy is valuable. Protect it well. You've got to set up some kind of boundaries, Sag, because it's looking like everybody coming to you who has a problem or dumping their problems on you. You care about people, but your energy is valuable, Sag. Protect it well. Again, find out what is the most important thing for you. What are your priority priorities? You may have to prioritize something here. Make sure you're prioritizing your health. And that could be 
Um, that could be the advice that someone's giving you or you're giving someone else. Your health is always the most important thing to look after your own health before anything else. I'm guilty, Sagittarius. I sit here and I sit here and I sit here and I sit here. And it's been hard on my health sitting so much. I'm not used to it. I'm used to being extremely active. And I've been sitting here in this chair for like going on four years. It's over three and three and a half years. That's really hard on your health. And I've got to get more active. And I've been saying it for days. So I got to actually make myself do it. Because my body is not accustomed to sitting around at all. Like weird things start happening to your body. And um, I'm not used to it. My body has never been used to it. I do not know how to sit around. And so that is also for me. I've got to get more active because, yeah, you got to prioritize your health. Guilty. Guilty. Take care, Sagittarius.